Jackie Knight, the woman, the myth, the legend, she is a light. Jackie is one of those people that has a heart bigger than anyone else I know. She really believes in young people and gives them the opportunity to succeed. Jackie was known for going above and beyond. She was just a pillar of support for all of us. She just kind of has just so much love to give and takes people into her arms and, and cares for them and I felt safe and loved and supported and but also pushed and challenged. I feel like in school you're kind of taught not to be creative and with Jackie it was like no your ideas are important. She would always say let your light shine that was her big thing. YPC has been a real home for a lot of young people. This is my favorite place to be. She just has this bubbly personality that made me feel like I could do anything. A lot of us feel like she's kind of Oprah to us. <laughs> I think what I gained was sort of this empathy and compassion and that's something that Jackie <laughs> really, um, I think, cultivated in all of us. That's the coolest part of Jackie and that, that's one of the greatest things about YPC. The profound effect that it has had on not only the individuals who have, who have been students and members there, but how they touch the rest of their communities and their families and friends after YPC is what's, is what's incredible. Jackie had us doing uh, a bunch of civil rights shows and would push us to have uh, maybe uncomfortable conversations. I lived in a small suburban town and we weren't having those. Jackie was able to connect me with people who I never would have met through theater. She didn't do the talking, but she connected me to the people who helped me become better. And that's just what she's been doing for me my whole life. She always pushed everyone to be their best, even if we didn't believe we could do it. She's like, I believe you could do it, so go do it. Jackie had a way of sort of amplifying who we were as people and getting the best out of all of us. The best pep talk you could ever have comes from Jackie. It feels like our connection was so special, our relationship was so special. The amazing thing is that I just know that there's so many people that can say the same thing. I love Jackie's laugh. When you get Jackie laughing, it's a good thing. When you could make her laugh in the back of the theater, you know, in rehearsal or something, that was just the best. Jackie has an incredible attention to detail. When you walk on that stage, your costume needs to be ironed. And you will hear that from many people. I iron and hang up my clothes because of Jackie. I was thinking about that. There's a phrase, no fakey foo-foo. Fakey foo-foo, baby. No fakey foo-foo. I thought that that was like a thing before Jackie, but no, it's like, it, this is her thing. That's her weird little word. When you're acting and it was clearly fake. She's like, we need this to be real, so no fakey foo-foo. Come on, be authentic, be real, try to be realistic. No fakey foo-foo here. There's a tradition at YPC that before every single performance, the cast will gather together and circle up. And then we would all sing, You Are My Sunshine. It gets everybody centered and focused right before they walk on stage. Before the show, you're putting on your costume, doing your makeup, chatting with your castmates, ha ha ha, laugh, laugh. But in that moment, we come together, we focus on the job at hand, and then out of that, we go right to places. You are my sunshine. My only sunshine. You make me happy. When skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away.